I really like it when I can grab a bag of catfish bait and go fishing at a local pond that was just recently stocked. And this is thanks to one of you. I got an email today saying that they did the kids rodeo here at this pond and had recently stocked it with catfish. Farm raised channel catfish. And in fact, let me read a piece of this email. My son fished the rodeo this weekend and hammered them on the now YouTube popular strawberry jello chicken. I don't know if I've actually used strawberry jello chicken here before, but I do know that I've used chicken liver before. I think it was marinated in strawberry jello. I really don't remember, but today I'm going to put Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets up against Catfish Pro Bait again. This is going to be a rematch of these two baits to see which one will catch more farm raised channel cats. And maybe this will come out as a good thumbnail too. But I'm going to get these in the water and see what I catch. I just about set these up for carp too until they sent me the email telling me that they filled this up with channel cats. I'm going to hook both baits similar. Just put it, you know, right through the bait with the hook exposed. This is the Team Catfish Fiber Nugget right here. And I'm going to use the park bench as a rod holder. I hear a lot of boats on the lake and there's a lot of people here at the park which is kind of normal for this time of year normal is good after last year catfish probate I think the last time I was here, one of these little guys almost pulled one of my rods into the water. I probably should have brought some rod holders, but hey, I'm going to use what I got here. Oh. Of course, it's going to be the Team Catfish first. Scaring other fish in the area. Nice channel cat. The Team Catfish double action circle hook has them pretty good. It's right on the lip. I was really hoping to get one on the Catfish Pro bait, but as usual, Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets, nice channel cat, farm raised channel cat. <laughs> This is one I would take home and fillet up and maybe eat, but I'm going to put them back in the water. It's going to be a lot of reflection on the water because of the sun, where it's at. I'm going to let this guy go. Maybe he'll grow up, get a couple more pounds on him. I will say this, you know, the Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets, it's a dough bait, and that's kind of what these farm-raised channel catfish what they grow up on it's usually a crushed fish meal where they add like flour and stuff to it to keep it together so what I feed my goldfish 
And you can see there's a lot of powder on this bait. A very doughy bait. I'll go ahead and reel this up and check this bait. Should still be on the hook. I haven't even got a single hit with it. And there's a dip there. Still on the hook. It's like a piece of cheese. Hasn't dissolved at all. Already got another one. I haven't even gotten this one out yet. Tried throwing this one where I threw this one. So it's close to the fish if they're gathered in that spot. Oh, he swallowed it a little bit. I'm gonna have to do some surgery on this catfish. It's on his tongue. Well, it's in there too deep. Can't get it out. It will rust out after a couple of weeks and the fish might spit it out in the next couple of days. But another one on the Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets. Really, really fast. Let's let this guy go. I'm trying to be really, really careful handling these. Their fins are super sharp. Can't really see them swim off either. Thankfully, I have one pretty snails right here. And maybe while I'm rigging this, the catfish will eat the cheese one. Maybe. Wow, that is a really short leader. show you guys this real quick that's a team catfish double action circle hook I've got it snelled to maybe 12 pound line and a barrel swivel and when the swivels connected I've got a one ounce no roll sinker and a little bead to protect the swivel knot real simple setup well no bites while rigging this another nugget actually using a tackle bag to hold down the rods so the fish don't take them. Even though they're small, they could still pull the rod into the water off to it. So I was like, I'm running here. hoping I'd get a train bite there. Oh, spoke too soon, didn't I? On the Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets again. <laughs> this would 
would be one heck of a fish fry if I was keeping them. I really wish I could get at least one on the on the cheese bait, on the catfish pro bait. But uh, Team Catfish is just out fishing it. The hook got this guy in the corner of the mouth. That's good. I don't think I have any more hooks with me. So hopefully another one won't swallow it. Now that was an easy unhook. A lot of algae in this pond too. This is a smaller one. Camel cat. <laughs> now I am on the Team Catfish promotional staff and that wasn't by my own doing. It was basically an honorary position because I use Team Catfish stuff all the time. And even though the Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets are out fishing the Catfish Pro Bait, I really, really wish the Catfish Pro Bait would at least get one fish. In fact, I'm going to throw this guy back and I'm going to put another Catfish Pro Bait out with this Catfish Pro Bait. One of these should get a catfish. Hopefully it'll get me one before it gets too dark to film. Since the fiber nuggets is whooping the catfish pro's butt, let's put two catfish pro baits out. there's an absolutely giant goldfish in the corner over there he's swimming away so I won't be able to film him I've heard there's big carp in this pond I might try for them again someday last time I went fishing here I only caught like a little bitty carp that was the goldfish <laughs> Maybe the goldfish will eat the cheese bait. That would be really cool. Just really quick, give you guys a closer look at the packaging. Catfish Pro Catfish Bait Cheese. And Team Catfish Fiber Nuggets Power Cheese Flavor. So at least they like cheese here. Be nice if they'd eat this bait. Ugh. All right, it's getting dark and I'm getting eaten up by mosquitoes right now. So I think I'm gonna call this. I really tried to catch a fish on the Catfish Pro bait and not yet. I did see some small nibbles on the right one and I've seen people catch catfish on the Catfish Pro bait in other videos. So catfish will eat it. It's just not my lucky bait. The Team Catfish Fiber Nugget seems to be a really lucky bait for me. I know some of you have said that you've used fiber nuggets and haven't caught anything with them. So maybe there is a little bit of luck involved. But I'm going to reel this right one in and see what the cheese bait looks like after getting nibbled on a couple of times. still on the hook and I really don't see where they nibbled on it and it was really really light bite it wasn't like what you saw earlier it just was like you know just a quick hit so I don't know what was going on and it wasn't buried in algae as you can see I guess I'm just unlucky with this bait all right, as always, I want to thank you guys for taking your time out of your day to watch my video. I really, really appreciate it. And as of the making of this video, I'm getting really close to 11,000 subscribers. So I can't thank you enough for subscribing to my channel. 
And if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. I put out weekly fishing content for everybody to see. Sometimes I do tackle and equipment, and most of the time, I'm trying to catch some fish. Although sometimes I'm skunked. And I'm totally willing to share sometimes when I do get skunked. Even to the detriment of my guide service. I'm going to get this one reeled up and I'm going to head home. Thanks again for watching and I hope to see you next time.